Hi guys, welcome back to my vlog channel. I am in way too good of a mood today. It's the morning time, naturally, it's early. I've just cleaned out the fire, I've just set the fire. And I'm actually going to have my breakfast right now. But I thought I would check in with you guys first. I, like I said, haven't been vlogging in a few days. I was with mum and dad and we decided that we'd stop into one of the place, what you call it, B&M shop. Oh my God, can't think of the name, but, but anyway, we stopped in and they have my curtains. So I got my curtains and I'll show you them now in a minute. I don't have my tie backs, they're on their way, but I have the curtains. I need to go and make the bed right now and I think that's pretty much all that's like kind of new and updated here. John and I went to Dundrum yesterday and we just kind of did a little bit of shopping, mostly for him because he needed new jeans and new jumpers and stuff like that and t-shirts and everything. So we got everything for him. I mean, he needs like a new winter jacket and stuff, but I let him deal with that by himself. We got Nando's yesterday and I haven't had that in ages. And you know when you haven't had Nando's in so long, you're kind of like, what is the ordering routine in here again? Do they bring the food to you? Do you pick up your food? What is the whole deal? I can never remember. Every time I go into Nando's and I just forget. It's been like six months since I've been in, oh no, it'll be longer actually. Jeez Louise, it's probably a year since I was in Nando's last. Anyway, so we had Nando's yesterday. I would like to go to the cinema this year. We want, uh, this year. <laughs> I would love to go to the cinema this week. A Star Is Born is out and I wouldn't mind going seeing it because Lady Gaga's in it and I love Lady Gaga. You can see my curtains there now. Obviously, I don't have the tie backs and they're a bit long. So I'm gonna get um, safety pins and pin them up and then probably run like a little stitch along the bottom of them. I'll show you what I got in pennies as well because I went there the other day or yesterday with John. Actually, I'm wearing one item that I got from pennies, which is this little Marie sleeping, sleeping dress. I was gonna call it night dress. And then I got another pack of socks as well. So I got some of them from pennies, the fluffy ones. These ones are kind of like blue. And then you've got pink and white ones and then stripey ones. I just thought that they were really cute. And then I got one other thing, kind of like two other things, but you'll see in a minute. Oh, I got a fitted sheet. I forgot about that. So that's for the bed. I have to change the sheets on our bed this week. But look what I got, guys. In the lounge where I got Marie Jammies. They are just the cutest thing ever. I think my obsession with her is just like becoming, you know, just unbearable probably. They were 12 euro for the top and then the bottoms were also 12 euro. But I mean, it's the cutest lounge wear I've ever seen in my whole life. Like just too adorable. I couldn't pass them up. And I mean, I'm so obsessed with Marie. So obsessed with her. So that's what I got in pennies. Nothing too exciting. That was my only purchase. Change the sheet. Change the sheets tomorrow. I couldn't find any nice bed sheets, like grey ones or not any colour. Like they'd no nice bed sheets and pennies. So I found a pair online. I ordered them. So I hope they're going to be here by tomorrow or the next day. They said they'd be here by the 16th. I'm not really sure what day today is. I think today is the 15th. So they should be here by tomorrow. Anyway, I'm going to make the bed here. And then I'm going to get myself dressed and I'm going to go for a coffee, I think, because I just feel like getting out and about and I don't know. Sorry if my mood's like really kind of like low. It's early, it's early in the morning and I'm just kind of like all over the place. Okay, so the bed is made and you will see a new addition over here, guys. So I got the bedside tables from ikea i put them together the other day i haven't done john's yet he was gonna do it himself but i was like no i want to do it he's like okay um so i'm gonna do that other bedside table today the other thing is these are my curtains so i'm just gonna like pull them a little bit so you guys can see them actually i'll pull them closed i know it's kind of dark but you'll be able to see them a bit better when they're kind of closed or maybe you won't <laughs> <laughs> Let's open them again. So yeah, it's really hard to show you curtains basically But anyway, they're this like silvery color and they're absolutely beautiful But you can see like how long they are onto the floor that I need to take them up just a little bit and Oh my god, what the hell is that? There's like stuff thrown on the floor John's belt for some reason is on my side of the bed anyway 
that's what the curtains look like so they are a silver color this is obviously like a lighter silver and then there's like a kind of darker silver pattern going through pattern going through them but i'm really really happy with them and then they're on the curtain poles up there with the little crystal balls on the end oh and also guys i never showed you this we have now got a kitchen table Ta -da! and these new chairs as well which john's daddy gave them to us so these are chairs that actually john's dad had in his home house like back when he was young and um what we're gonna do is like i asked like obviously did he mind if we painted them and he said there's no bother i can paint them do whatever i would like with them so i'm gonna paint them i think either duck egg blue or gray i haven't fully decided but i'm thinking more towards the duck egg blue would just be kind of nice like hint of color in here because even though the kitchen has like I don't know it's grey kind of and white theme and stuff I was having a banana and didn't finish it <laughs> I'm gonna eat that now anyway even though the kitchen has its kind of theme I just think like a pop of colour would be nice and then I ordered my rug which is going here I'll be here soon sorry guys it's really hard to see with the brightness I went to Ikea as you know so I want to haul all of this stuff there's more under there so that's why there's like a mess everywhere and then obviously you talk about like the other things that I got like the kitchen table and stuff like this. The tables, you know, it's not like, the most amazing, most beautiful, outstanding table ever but it has its purpose and it fulfills it. Okay guys, I am dressed and I'm gonna go for coffee and just get myself awake. I had breakfast so I'm good to go and uh, yeah I need to sort out this face do you know what I'd love to get this is a spray tan I haven't had a spray tan in years I know I suffer from eczema and stuff like that so getting a spray tan is not always a brilliant idea but I think that my skin would be okay because I haven't like touched self tanner in a while other than like you know the wash off stuff like the Bondi Sands one and stuff so I'd love a spray tan one because I'm feeling a little bit pale at the moment like so pale like I'm blending in with my my clothing at the moment I'm gone super pale so I decided guys after get my cup of coffee I am going to put together the unit for beside John's bed so the little locker and I'm gonna do that now so I will record myself doing that because it might be of interest to you guys to see me putting some Ikea furniture together it's called the Jimenez and it's in the white color so let's put this together that's a little picture of it there and you would have seen it from my bedroom so let's do this <laughs> This is my little bedside table. It's actually John's bedside table. I'm delighted that it's done, so I'm gonna go put it in the room now. Ah, oh, it looks so nice. So there's John's bedside table, and there's mine. So I'm really, really happy with them now. Obviously, there's still like a bit of work like to put things on the bedside table, but I'm very pleased. Okay, so my battery is actually dying. I'm gonna go charge it and I'm going to start on the TV unit and see how I get on with that because it's going to be a pretty difficult one to do but I am going to try nonetheless. Okay so the next challenge is this. <laughs> this comes in two boxes and it's the TV unit. It's the best unit for there because 
It's the best unit for there because, as you can see, at the moment we're using a copy table. It's just not ideal. There's like cables everywhere. It's just really messy. And I don't like being able to see tons of stuff underneath it. So this was the best one for the area that we have to kind of fit it into because we don't really have that much room there. So this is the one I got. I think this is only like 70 euro or something, so it wasn't too bad. But it looks like there's going to be a bit of work involved in this one. So let's get cracking lacking, I guess. I'm going to like separate all these bits out first because then I can see exactly what I got. God, guys, <laughs> remind me when I'm doing flat pack furniture again to really rethink it because that was an episode and a half. Like, it was actually fine to put the thing together, but I managed to put a segment that belonged to the back. Like, you know the way like there's like paint on the front, obviously, I put the paint segment on the back so the wooden section was on the front and I had to turn it around and take the whole thing apart. It's literally taken me two hours to do that and I would have had it together in probably about an hour and a half if I hadn't to redo that, so it's just really annoying. Also, my lip still looks really bad. I'm sorry guys, I should have said that earlier on. It's like healing. It's a burn, if I didn't mention that before. I burnt my lip off a toasty. Anyway, it's done. It's dusted. I am happy out that it's in. Oh, effort and a half, but I feel so like happy that I achieved that.
Oh, I'm so happy with it though. It does look lovely, doesn't it? I have to move this back over here. I'm watching The Simpsons <laughs> as well. I've just had it on like all day while I was doing this because it was easy listening and uh, you know, Simpsons, gotta love them. So yeah, I'm really happy with this. Um, I just took longer than I expected. <laughs>